How's it going everybody? It's Warren. Welcome back to my channel, The Cosmic Wonder, where we talk about all things Marvel and everything relating to the Marvel Cinematic Universe. Today we have some news about Thor, Love and Thunder, and about Chris Hemsworth, and whether or not he's going to be sticking around to play Thor after Thor, Love and Thunder, or if he'll be leaving the MCU like some rumors have said he was. But in a recent interview, he actually talked quite a bit about his future with the MCU, and he talked a little bit about the script and how excited he is for Thor Love and Thunder as well in a recent interview that we're going to break down. And we also do have some production news for Thor Love and Thunder as well. So if you're new, be sure to subscribe so you can stay up to date on the latest MCU news and so you can enter this week's giveaway for a chance to win a Gladiator Hulk Funko Pop. It ends on Monday. All you got to do to enter is subscribe, like the video, and leave a comment down below. So, like I said, Chris Hemsworth opened up in an interview with L. Mann, and the first thing that he was asked about is how he feels about Thor, Love and Thunder, and how he feels about shooting beginning next year. And here's what he had to say. After reading the script, I can say that I am very excited. For sure, there will be a lot of love and a lot of lightning in this production, and he laughs while saying this. I'm glad that after all that happened in Avengers Endgame, I'm still part of the Marvel Universe and we can continue the story of Thor. Of course, I can't tell you anything about the plot, but to satisfy your curiosity, I'll say that I had a lot more fun reading the script than on Thor Ragnarok and that proves something because this movie was brilliant. So I think everybody in the fandom pretty much agrees that Thor Ragnarok was by far the best Thor film. It was hilarious, it was really out there, it was action packed, it had a lot of good characters and a really good story. And right away, Chris Hemsworth is saying that he likes Thor Love and Thunder better than Thor Ragnarok, even though he does say Thor Ragnarok was brilliant, which means Thor Ragnarok is going to be even more brilliant. But after that, the interviewer brought up the topic of Thor possibly retiring as a character and passing on the title and hammer to another character, such as maybe Jane Foster Thor or simply another actor to play Thor. And this is what Chris Hemsworth said. Are you crazy? I'm not going into any retirement period. And he laughed while saying this. Thor is way too young for that. He's only 1500 years old. It is definitely not a film that I say goodbye to this brand. At least I hope so. So there you have it. For those of you who were concerned that Thor Love and Thunder was going to be Chris Hemsworth's last film as Thor, that is not the case. There was a debate for a pretty long time that Jane Foster was actually going to go on and take the mantle and we wouldn't have Chris Hemsworth in the MCU anymore. Or perhaps Beta Ray Bill could make an appearance in Thor Love and Thunder and he could take the place of Chris Hemsworth worst Thor. But that's not the case, and the way he talks, it sounds like he would like to do another team-up film as well. So it sounds like the Thor that we're going to have in the next Avengers is going to be Chris Hemsworth as Thor. Now, as far as the production of Thor Love and Thunder goes, it seems like they're starting a little bit early. Natalie Portman right now is currently in Australia, where they're planning to shoot Thor Love and Thunder. Now, of course, it is possible that she could be there for another reason, but Marvel Studios basically just opened back up. Production for the Falcon and the Winter Soldier has just re-begun, and we know that production on other projects are going to be starting up again really soon. So perhaps as a precaution, they're starting the production of Thor Love and Thunder early in case it does end up getting delayed at some point in time, they could already be ahead. That way if the virus makes them shut down for a little bit, it won't get pushed back because they prepared and started early. Based off of everything that we heard, production for Thor Love and Thunder was supposed to start at the beginning of 2021, so this would only be moving it ahead a few months. But the big news, Chris Hemsworth is here to stay in the MCU for a while. He has no plans on retiring from the role anytime soon, so he is going to be our true main Thor. So let me know what you think about this in the comments down below, and let me know how excited you are to see Thor Love and Thunder. From what Chris Hemsworth was saying about it, it's going to be an epic movie. So leave your comments down below. Don't forget to like the video and subscribe so you can stay up to date on all the latest MCU news. You can follow me on Instagram and Twitter. I'm giving away Funko Pop on there right now and as always thank you all so much for watching woof woof